Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello guys, good morning Let me just start by introducing myself My name is Ayu Agustina And right now I'm in the 6th semester of English department And from Darul Ulum Islamic University of Lamongan In this video I would like to tell about the material About the tourism planning And this video made for fulfill the assignment of uh, English for tourism before that, I don't forget to say thank you to my lecturer, Mrs. Daniel, as the lecturer of English for Tourism, and also my friend, who already given me the change to speak in this video. Um, let me just start. Uh, the first topic is, what the definition about tourism planning? The tourism planning is the process of considering the needs of people planning a trip and using these factors to determine the best resources, program, and activities for their trip. And the second is what the essence of the tourism planning. There are two essence. For the first is improve the condition with the government courses to improve tourism. Uh, related infrastructure and the second it is also attend the participation of the private sector such as hotel restaurants and travel transport and outlands and the next is what the consequence of having lack of tourism planning I mean uh, a poor tourism planning and the main consequence is the tourism is unorganized and uh, the other consequence is there are five impact uh, such as physical impact, human impact, marketing impact, organizational impact, and also other impact uh, such as high seasonality and short length of stay. And the next is about package and inclusive tours consists of the series of integrated travel services such as uh, transportation, transfer, guide, meals, and accommodation. And also there are the other requirements such as uh, health, safety, wealth, what a pig, uh, and general information in countries. And uh, the next is how to complete time scale for tour operating program and here there are five uh, uh, five following stage for the first stage is research and planning stage and the second is negotiation stage and the third is administrative stage and the fourth is marketing stage and the last is departure stage uh, the last is the most important point in this material these are the main pre-tour preparation a tour manager should make these are uh, confirming reservation writing out the report uh, evaluating and copying client inventory uh, for the confirming reservation is uh, we should confirming uh, what a client has booked uh, for example, when the client booking a hotel, we should confirm the reservation first. It is already uh, related to what they book or not. And the next is writing out the report. If there is a complaint, if there is a suggestion from a client to us, to our uh, planning, to our tours, uh, we should write down it and everything it is a complaint or it is a suggestion about our services we should write out that uh, and the third is about evaluating we should evaluating what uh, what our client already complain what uh, our client already suggests uh, about our services about our place about our tourism planning and the, the last is copy client inventory we should know uh, the destination that uh, client will go I mean uh, whenever a client will go we should know about it okay guys uh, that's all about I say about tourism planning I'm so sorry if I have uh, made a mistake uh, while tell about this material and the last I say Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh see ya